Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Lisa, and I'm here to share the latest word given to Allie Winters. The title is, Because You Have Trusted in Your Own Way, and this word was posted on April 26th, 2020. If our Savior had to hang on a tree before he could sit on a throne, should we expect to have an easier road than he is your life filled with difficulties and temptations? Then be happy, for when the way is rough, your patience has a chance to grow. So let it grow, and don't try to squirm out of your problems. For when your patience is finally in full bloom, then you will be ready for anything, strong in character, full and complete. Standing firm in faith means that we must set our will to decide to accept God's word that he is in charge, regardless of what our feeling or outward circumstances may be. The Bible firmly states that God is in charge of every rainstorm, earthquake, tornado, hurricane, every war, famine, pestilence and plague, every birth and every death, every flower in the field, every sparrow and every hair on our head. We must all decide whether or not to believe him. Where we refuse to see God's hand, we can never expect to see an answered prayer or his transforming power. Merlin Carothers power of praise. Sow righteousness for yourselves and reap faithful love. Break up your unplowed ground. It is time to seek the Lord until he comes and sends righteousness on you like the rain. What a wonderful God he is! From his hands flash rays of brilliant light. He rejoices in his awesome power. Pestilence marches before him. Plague follows close behind. He stops. He stands still for a moment, gazing at the earth. Then he shakes the nations, scattering the everlasting mountains and leveling the hills. His power is just the same as always. You have plowed wickedness and reaped injustice. You have eaten the fruit of lies. Because you have trusted in your own way, it is now time to allow God to be God. It is time to allow Him to do what only He can do. It is time we rise up and become that treasure hidden in the field, to become that little lamb sought by the Good Shepherd. Renounce our ties to this wicked and perverse generation and cling to the old rugged cross, laying down our burdens at the feet of the one who gave his life that we might be free. Wicked men trust themselves alone and fail, but the righteous man trusts in me and lives. And that is the end of this message. If you do not know Jesus as your Lord and Savior, please call out to him right now and ask him into your heart. Ask him to forgive you of your sins. And from then on, have a relationship with him. Talk to him every single day. This is what the Lord wants from us, relationship. He wants an ongoing, non-stop conversation and relationship with him. Please do this as soon as you can. Time is running out each day we get closer to the return of our Savior. I pray you all have a beautiful day in the Lord. God bless each and every one of you. And I will see you either next video or in the air. Bye-bye.